Hey, I'm Ted Sedalis, and this is another episode of Music Marketing Television. Today we're going to be going through the iRig. Just going to walk through a couple presets and how to uh, get around the unit. All right, so what I've done is I've set up uh, three presets. I've set up something uh, clean, kind of a countryish kind of tone, set up a uh, more of a rhythm crunch tone, and then uh, a lead crunch tone with a little bit of octave and delay. And we're going to show you how to get around this. It's very, very easy. Uh, didn't have to open up any manuals to look uh, to find out how to get around the machine. It's uh, you know very well laid out, just like uh, you know a lot of the stuff that you will find on, on the Apple uh, products. So uh, the first thing, obviously, that you want to do is you want to get into the amp, and you want to be able to, uh, you know, set it to the distortion levels and the volume levels and the kind of tone that you want. That's the basis of your uh, tone, just like it would be with a, you know, real guitar amplifier. Uh, so basically, right, right here, what we've got is uh, gain and uh, EQ and volume. So as you will see, if we just hit one of these buttons, then you get the scroll bar at the, at the side here, so we don't have to try and manipulate the icon, although we can if we want to. So going down, pushing the game. Very simple. The same goes for any of the other parameters, whether it be bass. Or any of the other um, uh, switches and knobs that you have. Now that we've set up a amp sound, basically the next thing to do is set up some effects. So we have our icons at the top that allow us to get around within the effects parameters. So uh, right at the top here you can see there's a number of different names of different effects. Delay, fuzz, overdrive, you know, and uh, so on down the uh, effects line chain including a, uh, a noise filter at the end. Uh, so basically what we can do now is by going into one of these parameters, whether it's, uh, you know, fuzz or um, uh, overdrive, we can set the amount of gain that we're going to have happen. Now, it's the same way that we set the, um, the volume and the gain in the amplifier, it's the same thing. Uh, we can either try and just manipulate this with our finger here, or you've got the, uh, the scroll bar at the side as well. So basically, less gain. Again. On or off. Okay, so uh, if we wanted to add some more effects, then we just go to one of the other effects parameters here, and uh, here comes the delay. You can see if you're again, you can have the choice of one uh, other beats per minute. Or you know just a general um, a time base uh, knob like you would get on a pedal. Uh, so for example, if I turn this on here, uh, you'll see that we've got uh, full parameter control, and we can control the amount of feedback. So however many repeats. One repeat, we can have lots of repeats. And we shut it off. Now, basically, uh, once we've set up the type of amp that we want to use, and we've set up the type of effects that we want to have, we can save these patches or parameters uh, as presets. I'll show you how to save this. So basically, there's a preset button at the bottom here. And what that will allow you to do is to go in there, and then you can set a new preset. So by holding down a number, I get the, um, the keypad, which allows me to put a name in for this. So uh, let's call this ZZZ. Uh, I'll just create, and there it is. So every time I want that particular sound, all i got to do is just hit that particular button, and then I'm going to go back to it. You all that crazy delay there. Back to another sound. Alright, so now, now you can see that basically you can um, store uh, the different types of sound, sounds you have. So basically, if you have a uh, nice little country tone that you've worked up. And uh, let's give the octave.
octave lead to try. So this sound has got a uh, high gain amplifier, uh, octaver uh, delay. Set a try. All right, so you can see it's really easy to scroll around different sounds that you've set up. Have fun, set up some cool sounds in your uh, iPhone or your iPad or your uh, iPod Touch and uh, take it away.